are. All right. And we're back. Yeah. And that was Aaron Carter. Some throwback <laughs> classics. Aaron Carter's Aaron's party. And <laughs> I was at, that was actually a part of my article that I was reading last night. Or two days ago. Mm -hmm. I don't remember, but I keep reading it because mm -hmm. it's my favorite. Oh, my music's still going. <laughs> Oh. Oh, oh, so this I found this article on Thor Catalog. First of all, Thor Catalog gets me, but besides the point, um, it's called Twenty One Terrible Ninety Songs That Everyone Secretly Loves." Or I openly love them, maybe. I, I actually do love them, yeah. and actually one of them was Aaron's party, Aaron Carter. Okay, so what's the first one? The first know? one is I love this song. This is such a shame. That's like on everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody, I cannot sing, but it's Backstreet Boys. Backstreet Boys. Yeah, back. All right. <laughs> That was a great song, great song. That is, I was more, because that was like the time of NSYNC and Backstreet Boys. Oh, come on. And uh, I was, actually, they released the Backstreet Boys was like, As Long As You Love Me and like, one other song, song before this. Um, and they have like two songs and they disappeared. Um, but you, As Long As You Love Me. Um, and then one other song and they disappeared for a while and they came back with that one. I forgot, but. Because that was on the first album. They only had two songs on the first album before that. Oh, I want it that way. No, that, that was no, good. That, that was released for the millennium. I'm talking about the first that album. album. And the first album had two songs, and that was the third song, so they disappeared. Because NSYNC took over. No, 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 no. This is what. No, listen. As long as you love me. I love that song. And this one, and another song. We were released in about 94, 95. Mm -hmm. But they disappeared until 98, and then he came back with the Backstreet Boys. Yeah. The NSYNC didn't come along until 1999. They did it? No. I, I was just too young and loving Nick Carter and J.C. Chazé. So I'm just telling you. I'm, so ta I'm just telling you. I didn't know that. Thanks for telling me that, Chris. Then they disappeared for like a year and they came... They, why didn't someone call Backstreet's Back? Because they, they disappeared for a while. Backstreet's Back. Okay. This next song. Next I, song. I, I played on the radio once before. Uh-oh. Men in Black. I haven't heard this song in years. Oh, I mean, I, no, that's based, that on, that's based on the old Chaka Khan song, Forget Me Not, which is an older song from the 70s. Oh, and then Will Smith recreated it? Exactly. He brought it back, he brought like a 70s jam to that. 70s jam. Oh my god, the third song is a recent song. What? Yeah, wait, what's on it? By Lamos, by Enrique Iglesias. I think his father was a singer, too. Yeah, his father, um... Was I so, Julio? Julio. Yeah. Julio. And oh, uh, didn't he sing? Did he sing for Miss David Down? He did. It? Julio Iglesias. I think so. Yes. That. Yeah, I, that's awesome. I think so. And, but then it's a new song. He recreate. I'm reading the article, and he recreated it to make it better. Which I don't like the Bailamo song. It's I wanna be con. Yeah, I'm not Is singing it on national on Is radio. It in it's in Spanish, and like I kind of understand it because I did take Spanish here already. But I don't know. It's not. Uh, I'm ne not next. Okay. You know that song? Truly, Madly, Deeply. I'll be your love, I'll be no. your wish. No. I don't like that song either. But I don't know it. <laughs> later on in life, uh, later on in life, later on in like the years, there's some EDM hip hop, not hip hop, pop singer sang it. Um, Cascada and shoot, that was my MySpace song. Uh, That's a throwback. No, I don't need MySpace. MySpace is what? My friend used it. I uh, used, I was all over MySpace. I asked my mother. I would get in trouble uh, a lot. Because MySpace. Ooh, next one. I Do by 98 Degrees. Oh, I love 98 Degrees. Mm, heard of them? Just don't remember. It was Nick Lachey and his little brother. And then, the, I forgot, there's one named Jeff. I don't know. But them. they're forgettable. 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 So you know uh, what? It's like every it's like it's like a bunch of nineties artists and early members. Ooh, if you're reading this next article, Chris. I don't want to think that's a great song. Yes! I, I mean, come on. That was with that movie with the um I'm again. Yes. I love this song. It's, I'm just a big Aerosmith fan, so I love Aerosmith. I mean, He's a boss. It's 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 five guys though. Yeah, um Even there, boss. Steven that. Tyler is a boss. He's awesome. He, I want to be. It might. He was my spirit animal because he's crazy, but he knows how to keep it together. His daughter's a good actress, though. His daughter? Yeah, Liv Tyler. Oh, I love Liv Tyler. That's his daughter. Oh my god, I knew that, but I love her. <gasps> Ooh, you don't probably know the song, Chris, but I was rocking out with my roommate Cynthia. What's up, Cynt? Um, last night as I was prepping for today's show. Uh -huh. Say Love V by Bewitched. I know that song. 
It was in the movie. It's saying it right here. My one of my favorite all time Disney movies, the Disney Channel classic movie Smart House. Never seen that one. Those, <gasps> the oh ones, goodness, the ones I like. The one I like. My favorite is um the one where what's it called? The guy, the kid, and his little brother, and he wishes he never was alive. What's that one? The one with with the guy from the Luck the, of the Irish, maybe? No, the one with e- the guy from Ian Stevens and the girl oh. from um Liz and Wire. What's it? You wish? Yes. Yeah. But Spencer Breslin is his little brother, yes. and, they, and then like wishes he never was born, and he was like a huge football player. Yes, I forgot what that movie is called. And then like, you know, wish, it's like you wish, right? Yes, you, you wish. wish. Yes. And I actually have some Disney movies up in here, but I don't think we're gonna have time for that. Uh. But next time, um, Baby Got Back. Uh oh. Oh uh, yes. Oh. Heard that for the first time in California. When? What, this year? Yes, because I have my I turned the radio, and that's what we was on. Oh, good, 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 goodness. And now it's coming back as Nicki Minaj. My Anaconda. Don't. Mm-mm. Yeah. No, 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 no. I'm not Nicki. I'm not Sir Mix-a-Lot. But that is a throwback that is coming back. So, yeah. kudos, Sir well, Mix-a-Lot. Well, my baby's got it back. It's coming back. <gasps> oh, you're saying that we were talking about this before. Yeah. Um, I heard that for the, I heard it, I heard it recently on uh, Spotify. I was on the radio. No, and no. this song is called Barbie Girl by Aqua. Now, a lot of people say that's the mean to wo- that's the grain to women. Do you agree with that? I you, I feel it's do, more I I feel don't. it's more of a protest song. I don't I think know. it's protesting the, the, the way women are viewed through the doll. I I kinda see that, but I think it's a jo- I'm a feminist. I'm all for feminism, go girls. But like I think it's just a Silly take on it. I shouldn't be taken too seriously. I don't think it should be either. Because it's the, just the people go against like, it. I'm I mean, a Barbie girl. Like, who wouldn't like? Some of the content in it is a little bit much for like an eight year old who, what at the time I was probably eight years old. Yeah, yeah. But right. I don't, I don't know. Who in 2002 love that song? Uh, Yonce is next. Say my name. No, I've never heard that song. Say my name. Say my name. When, oh my god. Today, a WICR is getting me my rarest <laughs> moment today because I'm dancing up a storm today. Say my name. Oh, my God. I love that This song. is a child. Well, Beyonce was the only, was Beyonce the only one that actually became famous out of that band. Actually, the, the when it became the three of them, Michelle Williams and um, Kelly Rowland. Yeah. Kelly Rowland has like sang, collaborated with Nelly like yeah. way back when for one of my favorite throwback songs ever, Dilemma. You know, the, no matter what I do. Yeah. I'm old. I can't sing anymore, uh. especially because Jersey Joe just walked in. Hey, hey no. um, what's this next song? I don't know. Is it? I have no idea. What is it? It is. I have no idea. When the lights go out by five. Nope. Nope. Next. Yeah. Great song. Kiss from from a rose. By I see. Seal. Great song. One of my favorite. One of my favorite movies from the nineties. Batman. That yeah, that was All she wants. What? Ace of Bases. Huh? No, no, okay. Breakfast at Tiffany's. By deep blue something. Uh, right, 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 right. Do you remember Breakfast at Tiffany's? Yes, I yes! remember the film. I, that's it. The next one. I think we're going to wrap it up after this song. Living the Vida Loca. Hey! hey! That's hey, a perfect son. way to. Man, yes, Ricky Ricky Martin. Thursday to start our weekend. Push. Oh yeah. my God. I love that song. When, yeah. when you think of that song, don't you get so happy? I, 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 I don't think that exercise. Me t- like, it's such a gets you going. You're so like, let's just finish the segment and we gotta give over to Joe. You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna end it off with this. No. What is your favorite song of the 90s? <laughs> oh, oh, dear. You're putting on the spot right now. I know. I, oh, that's what man. Throwback Thursdays with Chelsea and Danielle and now Chris is all about. Putting people on the spot. Um, oh, dear. Probably I would have to go with I Love Kiss by Rose by Seal. Oh, that's a good... That, that was on our that, that was a, that, 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 that was early. That was early in my life. It was one song I remember from when I was little. It makes me happy. It makes me remember when I was little. That was probably it. I will, um, this is... I love that song, too. You know what? My favorite song to wrap it up, to end up C- TBT with yeah. Chris D and Chelsea T. Um, my favorite song of the 90s has to be LFO, Summer Girls. We played that Oh, oh, oh. You oh. kids on the black coat. That's probably up there. I haven't placed those two on the same See, level. Yes. The world number one, my mind. All and right. You know what? For th- on that note, we're going to wrap it up for today. Thank you for listening to WICR. I'm Chelsea. I'm Chris. And see you next week. Signing off. Bye. Bye.